Well, Britt and Sarah, the writing is on the wall, and as the sign says, the CVS here on Farmington Avenue will officially close for good soon, leaving air people in this area taking longer commutes to get to the drugstore. This comes at a time when areas businesses across the state are closing and even experiencing layoffs. It's just a bummer because this is like where our pharmacy is. We walk by here every single day. We're always going in to get just random stuff. It's, it's a fun activity for the dog. They're dog friendly too. CVS announcing it will be closing its West Hartford location on Farmington Avenue on September 20th as the company plans to cut costs and focus more on health care rather than the retail portion of the business. CVS expects to close 900 stores across the country, including this location in West Hartford leaving people nearby going further to pick up their prescriptions. And it's too bad that there's now not going to be a drugstore in this whole area. Um, so that's a shame. This store joins a growing list of businesses who are shutting their doors. In July, Christmas Tree Shops announced it was closing its remaining locations after filing for bankruptcy. Various restaurants are calling it quits, struggling to catch up after the pandemic. And Norwalk-based Frontier Communications is considering moving its headquarters out of state. Earlier this week, CVS Health, which is the parent company of Hartford-based Aetna, announced it was laying off 5,000 employees nationwide. Despite the recent headlines, the Connecticut job market continues to improve, according to the July job report. Connecticut is now 98.2% recovered from the COVID shutdown, with the private sector just 100 jobs below the February 2019 level the last month before the pandemic. Connecticut's unemployment rate fell to 3.6%, the lowest level since September 2019. But for people like Merle, who have a long history with the CVS, the news of its closure is bittersweet. I have a warm spot for this building. Uh, and I hope they do something good with it. A CVS spokesperson told me that there are no other uh, closures expected in the state of Connecticut. Now, if you do have prescriptions at this location, you can get them transferred to a more convenient location. But if you don't do that by uh, September 20th, they will be automatically transferred to the location on South Main Street. Live in West Hartford, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.